Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. And if it's your first time here, welcome. Please do hit the subscribe button. I talk about various topics from new motherhood. I am a new mum, uh, fashion, lifestyle, and a bit of productivity thrown in as well. So today I want to talk about new mum essentials because I feel like as a new mum, I bought so many things I ended up not using and that was like a total waste of money. So I want to save every other new mum out there from wasting money on things that are not essential by just honing into those, you know, essential items. So obviously we all know that, you know, when you're having a baby, you need uh, onesies, uh, preferably the zipper onesies because they're much easier to change your baby in and out of. You need diapers, but there's some less obvious items that you may not have thought of that have definitely come in handy. Um, for me while taking care of my newborn. So first up is the Angel Care Bath. The Angel Care Bath is an ergonomically designed bath uh, for babies. It comes in a range of colors. I think we have the pink and my daughter loves it. You sort of sit them you know in there uh, to give them their bath and uh, my daughter is, well, she's just under three months now but when she was a newborn newborn like you know a week or two um she was so small when they're that age they're so small uh, so it really helped us in obviously bathing her and we still use it uh, till today and i'm sure we can still use it for quite a while to come next up is the tommy tippy perfect prep so the tommy tippy perfect prep is best described as a sort of baby cappuccino machine um it is a very quick way of making up a uh, baby formula so if you are combination feeding that's feeding your baby formula and breast milk or just formula this machine is a lifesaver it literally um, makes up the formula in under three minutes so you put the formula in there and you put it in the tommy tippy machine it puts in hot water first and um, you shake it around then it puts in the cold water you shake it around again and then the um, formula is at the perfect temperature to serve so none of that you know having to boil water and all of that faff just makes it a lot easier and quicker um and you know how babies are when they're hungry they they're very impatient so this has definitely been a lifesaver. Uh, next up is um, the changing mat. So the mat we have, I'm going to link and I'm going to put a picture of it right here. It's um, a very padded, uh, foamy changing mat. And I found that it keeps my daughter calm. You know, when she's getting her diaper changed, she loves being on there. Sometimes you just put her on there to play uh, randomly because for some reason I think she just enjoys it. And it's made of this vinyl material, so it's very, very, very easy to clean. So that's definitely been a fantastic buy. Uh, next up is the Ergo Baby Carrier. So, you know, before I had a baby, <laughs> I thought, you know, a baby carrier is a baby carrier, but clearly not. The Ergo Baby is made of this really soft material. And um, I know that it is exceptional because we also have the Nuna carrier and my daughter fusses around in that. She's not really a, b a big fan of that. I think it's a bit sort of, um, the material's a bit tougher, but with the um, Ergo Baby, once we put her in there, um, she sleeps almost immediately. So, you know, when going out, um, it's just the perfect way to carry her. And uh, we found that it stopped a lot of tantrums, you know, just having her in there. She's good. She's good for like a little while. So next up um, is the um, two types of bottles, NUK and Komo Tomo. So the NUK bottles um, have uh, this um, orthodontic teat and, you know, for newborns or for my newborn, she loved that. She was able to control the flow of uh, the milk. Uh, we tried some other bottles before we discovered the NUK and we found that um, she sometimes would um would cough a lot or choke a little bit because she maybe the the the, the flow of the teat uh, was a bit too fast that it was meant to be a newborn teat whereas with the nuk she was able to feed comfortably and she really enjoyed that and we found you know the same with the komotoma bottles which are meant to have like a nipple like teat um the technology of the komotoma bottles is really really unique you guys can read up on it i'm going to link it down below so those two bottles nuk and komotomo uh, we found really really helpful i know some people talk about liking the tommy tippy bottles we have those but my daughter didn't take to them as much as the others so that's why i'm mentioning those um next up is the docker tot so the docker tot is like um a baby sort of um, enclosure it's like a little um foam sort of enclosure you can put on your couch and if you're watching tv uh you can just have your baby next to you just chilling my daughter loves it 
Um, what I will say though is, an, it's, is that it's a little bit expensive and when I went on Amazon, I did see um, dupes for it that seemed to be pretty much the same thing but at a more reasonable price point. So if you're not looking to spend that much and you want to get something similar, I'm also going to link the dupes down below because who doesn't want to save a bit of money? I mean, yeah, makes sense. And then, so I've got the list here, that's what I'm looking down. So next up is Avino Baby. When uh, my daughter was a little bit younger, she had um, like a rash on her face and we were told that it's totally normal um, and that it's newborn rash. So at that point we were using Mustella products on her because someone had recommended Mustella and um, yeah, she had the rash like all over, like under her chin. Um, we told it was just normal, but we then switched to the Avino Baby range of products. And when I tell you that the rash disappeared, yes, it did. It totally, totally disappeared. And um, I'm, I don't know if she grew out of it, but it, or if it was, you know, the result of switching over to the Avino products. But we've stuck with um, Avino Baby products ever since, and her skin has been glowing and lovely. So I would definitely recommend the Avino Baby range of products. Right, so now let's move on to items for mums because us mums, new mums, we go through a lot. It's a whole new phase and I think sometimes it's easy to neglect yourself because obviously you're taking care of the baby and you want to do everything to make the baby as healthy, happy and comfortable as possible. But um, I feel it's also important to take care of yourself because if you're healthy and happy, the baby's going to be healthy and happy. So, you know, there are just little things you can do or that I did anyway, that help me feel a whole lot better. Um, and I'm still in that newborn phase, obviously. So these are the things that have helped. So first up, um, cute pajamas. When you've just had a baby, you're going to be at home, you're breastfeeding or you're formula feeding. Um, you're at home, you're taking care of your baby, but you still want to look good. Um, and I feel like silk pajamas are that perfect blend of like looking cute, but feeling comfortable and homely and you know when people come over as well you don't want to be scrambling to look for something to wear luckily there's that pajama trend now where you know you can kind of wear pajamas out so yeah perfect so pajamas um there's a bunch of cute ones on um amazon um zara do cute ones as well i'm just going to link some of the ones that i found online that i think are really really nice and then you can you can check them out next up is a support belt so if you've had a c-section please do talk to your doctor before getting a support belt but a support belt is it's like a well the one i used was made of a very sort of um soft thin material so it's not at all like a waist trainer it's just like a very comfortable um band that basically um helps you feel supported um because you know after you've had a baby your organs are still kind of trying to shift back into place so i would wear that um a couple of hours a day but i wasn't sort of very regimented about it i would just wear it as and when um i remembered or i felt like i wanted to and that definitely helped to give me a lot of support um to my core so i will definitely be linking that down below so you guys can check it out next up is a journal um i feel like you know they call that newborn phase, um, it's called the fourth trimester, I guess. And you're going through so many different emotions, especially as a first time mum. You know, you're you're just sort of bonding with your baby. You're trying to get a hang of uh, your baby's routine. You're trying to get a hang of breastfeeding. You're trying to get a hang of your new identity. It's a whole lot. And I found keeping a journal, especially a journal that has motivational quotes in it, um, definitely helped me to stay positive and to feel sort of connected to myself. Um, the journal I got is from Etsy. I'm obsessed with it, it's amazing. I'm going to link the exact journal that I got and that I used um, down below. And last but not least is the, this might sound a bit random, but the Moroccan Rose um, Tree Hut Body Scrub. Now, when I tell you that this body scrub will make you feel as if you are in the spa, but you're actually in your bathroom, I'm not kidding. Um, I'm a big fan of the spa and, you know, using this body scrub every single day after um, I gave birth, I only use it while I was pregnant actually, um, helps, like just helped me feel just a little bit more like myself, like I was having a mini spa date every single day. And, you know, being a new mum, sometimes you don't even get to shower until, or bathe until much later in the day because you're taking care of the baby's needs and your sleep schedule is all off. Anyway, so this was just like a nice like time out and it helped me feel sort of pampered and I don't know, it gave me that extra boost of um, yeah serenity um, that was really, really nice. So I'm gonna link that down below. Um, I hope you guys like 
my recommendations please let me know um if you've used any of them before and if they have helped and um yeah i just i'd love to connect to you guys more do talk to me in the comments and i will see you in my next video